In this video, I will show you how to automatically populate form fields with the data from another form after submission using Gravity Forms. When we input data on the form, basically, what will happen is that we will then redirect it to the page with a longer form that contains fields filled with our previously inputted data. In this example, I have two forms called the short form and the long form. Then I created these two pages with the two forms. Let's open the short form page which contains fewer input fields. The long form contains much more fields. Let's open the short form confirmation settings. Edit the default confirmation. For confirmation type, select redirect. Use the long form URL as the redirect URL. For the query string, let's use F name as the parameter name to hold the first name. Click on the curly brace toggle menu to use the template tag. Make sure to add an ampersand symbol to add more parameter names and values. L name to hold the last name. Select accordingly. Let's customize this parameter name and change it to email address. Now, open the long form, and let's edit the fields. Click on the field, go to the advanced option and check the allow field to be populated dynamically. Add the parameter names. The same process as the email field. Finally, let's refresh the page and test it out. We've successfully passed the form data from another form. Thank you for watching.